There are 22 different types of healing in Brawl Stars, and today we're going to go through all of them to order which ones are going to give you the most overall healing and will be best in whatever team composition you're trying to use. So I've split them into four separate sections. First, I divided them into ones that heal you personally and only affect you, and then the other group is for team healing effects, where you can heal everyone on your team at the same time. And within each of those groups, I've also split it into healing that is capped, meaning that you can only use it a few times per match like a gadget or a super or something like that and then there is the uncapped healing which is something like constant passive healing throughout a match or something you can just use with your normal attack it's not technically uncapped but you can basically just spam it the whole match and it'll still give you that healing and I've ordered it by the least amount of health you gain all the way up to the most health you gain for each individual section so first, with limited use personal healing, we have Jean's Gadget, which gives you 1000 health every time you use it. Bull's Gadget also immediately restores 1500 health per use. With Shelly's Band-Aid Star Power, you get 1800 health back when you drop below 40% health, and you can recharge this every 20 seconds. With BB's Gadget, you get 600 health per second for 4 seconds, so that's a total of 2400 health you get per use. With Mortis' Super, every time you hit a Brawler, you get an extra 1260 health back for a max of 3780 with one Super, but I would say on average you're gonna hit 2, so that's about 2520 health per use. M's Hype Star Power gives you 400 health back per second per enemy inside the range of your Super, and this lasts for 5 seconds, so that's a max of 2000 health you can get per brawler within your super. So on average, if you have one to two brawlers in your super, you're gonna get about 3,000 health per use of this. Spike's Fertilized Star Power gives you 800 health per second when you're in the range of your own super, and this lasts for five seconds, so that gives you 4,000 health per use. With Sandy's Gadget, you can charge all the way back up to full health as long as you wait a couple seconds, so that can technically get you over 5,000 health back every time you use this. Leon's Invisiheal star power gives you 1000 health per second while you're invisible. Multiply that by 6 seconds and you can get 6000 health per use as long as you get damage in the middle since Leon doesn't even have 6000 health. Now moving on to the uncapped personal healing, you have Nita's Bear With Me star power that recovers 500 health whenever the bear hits, which could happen a lot in a match or it could happen not a lot, that's why I put it in this section. Rosa's Plant Life star power heals 200 health per second in a bush. Mortis's Creepy Harvest Star Power heals 1800 health every time you kill someone. And Barley's Medical Use Star Power is probably the best out of all of these and it heals 400 health every time you attack. Now moving on to the abilities that can heal your entire team at once, starting with the limited use abilities. At the bottom is Pam's Gadget, which gives 1200 health back to everyone inside her turret range every time you use it. Then is Sandy's Healing Winds, which heals 250 health per second for 9 seconds total, so that means you can get up to 2250 health back per brawler inside your super every time you use it. Then you have Poco's Gadget, which heals 500 health per second for 5 seconds to everyone in range after the first couple seconds after you use this gadget. So that means you get 2500 health per person who you are getting this ability off on. And then at the top is Poco's Super, which heals 2940 damage to everyone who gets hit by it. Then for the uncapped team healing, first off is Pam's Mama's Hug Star Power, which heals you and the people around you for 40 health per hit for a max of 360 healing per attack, but typically on average I'd say you hit about 5 of your bolts, so about 200 health per attack is a safe estimate. Next is Terra's Healing Shade, which once you spawn it with your super, it heals 400 health per second to a single target. I put this in the uncapped section because it could stay out for a really really long time and heal you for a huge portion of the match. Then is Jean's Magic Puff Star Power, which heals 400 health per second as long as they're somewhat close to you, and then Pam's Super, her healing turret, which gives 448 health per second as long as you are near it. And then finally, the best of the best for the uncapped team healing is Poco's Dakapo Star Power, healing anyone who you hit with your normal attack for 700 health. You can spam this the entire game and just keep healing that 700 health, so it definitely gives you the most healing by far out of all of these star powers in all four sections, so this is kind of broken. But that's going to wrap it up for this list. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like and a comment down below if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to see more content like this. But that's all for today, guys, so see you later.